Okay. Cool. I'm in the right spot again. We should put a cross on the ground like X Factor. So I started working with Slatino about five or six years ago when it really started coming into development field trials. We looked at quite a lot of different formulations early on just to try and get it the right formulation. Do you want the actual answer? Or... Yeah. <laughs> no, you're not getting that. <laughs> Within the technical trials, we're trying to show Slatino's as good as we say it is. You're trying to find the needle in the haystack. This is showing off that needle. It's not so much a trying to prove that this works. This is a, we know this works, now we have to prove for the people that it's as good as we say it is. So the field trials that we're doing range from about one and a half by three metre plots versus a farmer's field, which could be acres and acres and acres. My job is to replicate what farmers do as best as possible to represent what the chemistry will be like in the field when it finally gets to market. So we have to make sure it's not ideal conditions like a glass house would be. It has to be a real world application that farmers would use. You need to test it in a lot of different media. So we go to a lot of different farmers. It's tested not only in the UK, but all over Europe and all over the world. So putting ourselves on farm, let's just test the compounds in, in a real world scenario. You're primarily looking for crop safety, first of all, whether or not it has any adverse effect on the crop. It's usability, so how is this compound? Is it mixing well? Is it spraying well? Is it easy to use? From day one, when we first started working on Slatino, you could see from the very first assessment it was the best product that we were testing. So it was really nice to be able to work our way along the plots and you can almost pick out the Slatino treatments because there's no disease in them. You could quite easily tell from an early stage even which ones were Slatino. From that point you start to believe everything and it's very good to see that not only do we have a really good product that is coming through but on the home straight it's past all these hurdles that normally everyone falls down on. One of the most satisfying things about being a field biologist within St. Genza is that I get to see a very large part of the picture. I see it from quite an early stage through to farmers seeing it in the field. It's nice to see it in the field being talked about and being shown off because I've seen it progress to this stage. So it's nice to see the whole picture and you do, you do get proud. We have all played a part. Lots of us are involved in getting it to market and it's nice to be part of that. It's nice to be part of this global team of one goal and that's to get this product to market.